G'day guys, so I'm back out tonight chasing the wild dogs. Uh, I've had a phone call from a landowner that there's been a few about. So I've got the 2A4 and the thermal. Let's go and see what we can find. Righto, so I've just had a quick look through the thermal. Right across the uh, the big creek system that I'm above, uh, the owner's house is on one side, and he's um, he's got some flats and then a, a big ridge line. So there's um, there's definitely something out there with a thermal signature that's alive. Uh, that looks not like a cow. Uh, so I'm going to close the gap a little bit at the moment. It's about 700 yards, so we'll slip in a bit closer and see what I can find. So I've just popped my head up. I'm going to be pretty quiet. I've ducked back down over the bank. Uh, there's three dogs up here. I don't know what they're doing. They're eating something. So, uh, yeah, it's pretty windy tonight. It's probably 25k winds. Uh, it's really cold. It's snowed on the ranges today. So um, at the moment, I'm about probably 300 underneath these dogs. Uh, I just got a little bit of footage through the thermal, which I'll splice in. They had a big biffo. So dog number three is... Um, probably copped a bit of a flogging from the other pair there seems to be two hanging around one spot so um i'm going to close in you probably won't see it in the video but the moon's at about 80 percent so it's pretty bright so what i'm going to try and do is put a couple of these trees out in the paddock between me and where the dogs are so hopefully i can use them as a bit of cover because there's no cover between me and them it's just um, like loose and flats pretty much to get out to them. So um, I'll put a bit of a stalk in across this flat. I'll see how I go. So that's the go. Uh, the plan worked. I did get in on those dogs. Uh, took a little bit of mucking around for them to get in the right spot. So I had to wait probably about 15 minutes for the first one to turn sideways. The other one was laying down, I think, in the grass having a chew. So, um, yeah, two down. Let's go and check them out. That was worth the effort tonight. It's uh, crappy weather. It's pretty windy. It's very cold. But I thought the old dog's got to eat. So first shot on this female at the front here was at 156 yards uh, I just ranged that and that second fella up the back there which was its partner was at 290 on the trot so uh, I think that's not bad shooting in anyone's book especially um, especially in the wind with a 204 so uh, yeah good outcome did take a second one to put him down for good but just for context of what we're doing um, that's a wombat that they've killed and they're proceeding to eat so you might see on the video them chewing on something, and that's what it was. So, uh, yeah, pretty happy with that. Uh, Landane is very happy. I've just sent him a text message, and he's stoked. So, as usual, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Uh, subscribe to the channel for more content, and I'll see everyone next time.